here we are. It's just as I predicted. Siblum. A mere tool of the Sith Empire, just like the beasts in House Thule. Sent to wrench the throne of Alderaan away from those who rightfully possess it. Hey, it's Steve Blum, guys. Say hi to Steve. No. No, that's the guy who voices this character. I recognize the voice. It's Steve Blum. He's one of my favorite voice actors. He's incredibly good at what he does. I have no patience for your self-righteous prattle, King. Of course not. If you cared at all for the good of others, you wouldn't be here. I was the only one strong enough to do what was necessary. The people of this world deserve a leader who will defend them. I will not surrender this throne for you or for anyone else. Oh, I'm getting Only bored with I you, man. Keep it safe. Only I can protect Alderaan. Your ego is overinflated. I believe I've tolerated your intrusion long enough. Good. Time to fight. Destroy this assassin men! Defend your king! Defend Odoron! Okay then. to destroy the generators, don't I? Yep. I'll need heavy ordnance to destroy that. What? Where do I get heavy ordnance? Hmm. Uh, over there? Eh, maybe. Let's try. Yes. Yep, heavy ordnance right here. That's cool. Well done, droid. Oh, wait, we need to grab the uh, other ordnance, right? The giant moth.
nice job, but she almost died. Let's heal up before we destroy the thing, because I know we'll have to fight people right after I destroy it. I don't want her to be, uh, I don't want her to die. Final one. Alrighty. Now we just have to defeat. Uh, and we just have to defeat. Uh, uh, Olgo's Royal Guardsman and then Olgo himself. Olgo's Royal Guardsman will be easy to kill. Done. Talk to me, bud. This is not over. I'm not dead yet. But you're about to be. I won't let you win. I won't let the Empire's shadow fall over Alderaan. Your life ends now. So ends the reign of Boris Orgo. For Alderaan! Of course, Joker. Yes. Area secure, everyone. Looks like the hard part's been taken care of. That's him, isn't it? Boris Olgo has finally been defeated. That voice the sounds Usurper's really reign familiar. Has finally ended. Lord Orin, the mission was a success. Boris Olgo is dead. Dead? Hmm. That's no more than that traitor deserved, I suppose. Lord Victus, our house owes you and House Thule a great debt. You are very gracious, Your Lord. Ship. We are only too happy to grind this treacherous scum under heel on behalf of the people of Alderaan. Isn't that right? It is always an honor to serve, my lord. We are honored by your assistance. You have removed Boris Ulgo from the throne and proved House Thule's commitment to the future of Alderaan. Yes. So, you will have my support. Will your influence be enough to persuade those misled brothers and cousins of yours who have sided with House Organa? I'll do my best, but the Organos may not take well to losing. I fear this conflict could be far from over. After all that I've done, House Thule's position still isn't secure. It is only a matter of time. 
You should be satisfied that you have the opportunity to play such a large role. Okay. Your work is done for the time being. Yes, fine. You can go on about your own business. Finally! Holy crap! Gosh! Been doing this guy's dirty work for like the past three hours. Gosh. Ooh, a new lightsaber. It's a oh dude, it has a curved blade, just like Dooku. That's so sick. I wish I could get that blade on my current lightsaber, but it's not as good. It's unfortunate. Dang it. It's awesome. Oh well. this oh lore object I see okay now we move on oh, freaking Gosh, been doing all kinds of crap for these dudes this whole time. Ugh. Peoples, much foolish. Oh, they're from. They're behind it. Gosh. There are 17 more back here that I need, I need to kill. Someone has been killing them. Hmm. It's 
check it out. Ooh. Hey. Aha! Ten more. Four more. that little cavern area. Anyway. Oh, man. All right, we're back. Oh, hey. You miss me? I took care of the Organon offensive. The all goes too. Now our army will easily take the castle. This could deliver an alliance with House Pantheer. House Thull and the Empire have you to thank. All right. All that remains is my payment. Of course. I've even dipped into my wow, personal stuff. Wow, that guy shouted. Of course. I've even dipped into my own personal stuff. For the glory of the Empire. For the glory of the Empire. Bet you get new gloves. Level 34. <laughs> now to get the gosh darn crud off this planet. Go to my ship. Ready for departure. Enjoy your stay. Destination. Oh my gosh. Alright, while I'm traveling, I'll be right back, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. Nap time. You going to bed, Beer Key? You getting off already? I think it is pretty dang late. I'm still traveling? You gotta be kidding me. I was gone. All the time I was gone, I'm still flying? Dude, this is something wrong with the, pl the navigation on this planet. I mean, Tatooine was bad, but it wasn't this bad. Everything is slower on gosh dang Alderaan. Why? This is some gosh dang poop. Force. Oh. This is some poop. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. <laughs> no, I'm here. Alrighty, dude. I got you. I got you, boy. 
I want to have normal crud. If you're not sure if something is wrong with you. Wait, this is from Jasa, isn't it? My spy has been sent a message intended for Noma Carr. The paddle on anguish is over her parents' loss. Excellent work, apprentice. To Noma Carr from Jason Wilson. They're dead, master. I know it. I felt their final painful moments. My parents gave up their gave up, gave up everything for me. Now they're gone because of who I am, what I've become. This has to stop. Yeah, Jason Wilson's feeling it. She's feeling the dark side. She's feeling the pain. I've killed her. Ma I killed the man who. I killed the man who taught her the ways of the Force. Uh, I mean, I, t I killed the man who taught her how to use the Force. I killed the I killed her own parents. Now she's feeling it, and now she she think she says it has to this has to stop. Now she's gonna try and confront me, and when she does, I'll destroy her. I'm actually not gonna try and kill her. I'm gonna try and turn her to the dark side. I'm gonna try to ki to turn J the his apprentice to the dark side. Tell me more. Mm -hmm. We're almost done with Act 1, guys. We're finished on Alderaan. This is the farthest I've ever made it with any Star Wars character. So we're almost done with Act 1. I believe after we finish Alderaan, that's when we're done with it. That's, what, that's the end of Act 1, I believe. So let's go. Miss me? I did. Let's go. in freaking Alderaan anymore um, if if the reason if the point of this whole part is for Bioware to make the Imperial version of Alderaan so bad that they wish I mean they're glad that in the future it gets destroyed by the Death Star then they, they accomplish that like that's how I feel I, I want I want Tarkin and Vader to blow it up Ugh. all right let's listen I'll be quiet. You crushed Alderaan under your boot, Apprentice. I am incredibly impressed. The planet will feel the sting for years to come. I savored the destruction. Yet all this is merely prelude. Noman Kar's Padawan can no longer hide in anonymity. I am pleased. By rooting out this Jason Wilson's parents, you have reached across the galaxy to strike a sharp blow at our enemies. Every lead followed perfectly, every planet ravaged. Our adversary is growing antsy, I can feel it. Expect news soon. Barris out. It's the first time I've ever heard him say Barris out. To interrupt Darth Barris. We received a recorded transmission. It is queued when you are ready. Sith, I'm Jason Wilson. My master, Norman Carr, has no idea I'm sending this message. Let's be real. We both know this isn't about us. Ah. The hunted seeks the hunter. Our masters pretend otherwise, but this is personal. You and I are only pawns in their private war, and those I care about are caught in the middle. It has to stop. Wow. Gotta give it to her. She sure got guts. She certainly does. I appreciate directness. Your brutal actions have my attention, but this passive-aggressive foolishness is intolerable. This message includes coordinates where I'll be waiting in my ship. Let's discuss this face-to-face. -face. No more nonsense. What do you think of that, Captain? It could be a trap, my lord. Noman Khan may have put her up to it. Hey, don't listen to Captain Paranoid here. I don't think it's a trap. I trust her. <laughs> Thanks for the input, Ned. The coordinates are set, my lord. <laughs> oh, Quinn doesn't like that. Whenever you give the word. 